What's Welcome. up, guys? <laughs> oh my god, so y'all would not believe. So we tried to fill the film the mukbang, what mukbang, whatever the fuck it is. <laughs> and it wouldn't upload. Right. So I guess they were like, oh no, y'all done already did three videos. Y'all ain't doing four. You know, you Anyway, our video got dismissed. Right. Completely just dismissed and it was a great video by the That way. food was awesome. Yeah. The conversation was great. Mm-hmm. So anyway, that's what happened with that. That's why y'all didn't get to see our mukbang video. So. <laughs> y'all I'm stuck like okay. So what happened was I was coughing and coughing because somebody gave me a cough. What me? That's my husband. Okay, so I took me some promethazine and um that shit. Woo! Woo! Yeah. Don't don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Just don't, just don't do it. Don't do it. Bad. So we're in the car chilling because all of our family members are asleep. They're they're being born. Party poopers. It's the weekend, man. You ain't gotta go to work. You ain't got nothing to do tomorrow. Hey, why are you going to bed? Yeah. Man, it just don't make sense. It was dumb. So we're chilling in the car. Oh, I want to rest again. Anyway, I didn't see that. Booyah. I, I, Miss Smokey Smokey over here. Got it. <laughs> anyway, anyway, so we be doing some crazy shit sometimes. I'm sorry, but if y'all like weirdos and do crazy shit, that's Wait, what's up. We not bring a lighter. Oh, don't tell me we didn't bring a lighter. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Just got the lighter. Plus the little things in life that make her happy. Look, she lit, I lit this lighter earlier, right? This one, right here. And I almost lit my eyebrows on fire. The flame said, whoo! I was like this close to burning my eyebrows off. Mm -hmm. I really would have been looking crazy. Those lighters suck. They're the cheapest lighters ever. But... I hope y'all guys are having a great night. And I hope y'all like this uh, late upload. Yeah. Early morning upload. That's what we'll say early morning. Yeah, because it's like 1 o'clock in the morning over here where we're at. Georgia. Yeah. But. I can't believe our mutt bone got messed up. It was sad. It was really sad. That food was awesome, guys. Y'all need to try that recipe. Or something similar to it. Add your own flavors. And I was trying to edit the whole thing together. But what happened was, whenever I stopped the video, it completely... Because, we, okay, we're working with what we got here. And what we got is a cell phone and Android. And then, we got all these little different apps or whatever that we can deal with that are, you know, free. In order for us to, like, be able to edit stuff. So, I mean, it just didn't work out. So, I just figured I'd make it part one and part two and be able to do it like that but so if anybody has tips that's been doing youtube for a while about how to edit and different things like that comment below and let us know that'd be great because we're new at this and we're still trying to work out the kinks right right like we don't know i don't know how to edit so i got to sit down it's probably going to take me like five hours just to sit down and freaking learn how to do all the stuff that I got to do. But I heard um, iPhone, what is it, I, iPhone movie or iPhone Pro or something like that? Yeah. Was cool. And there's some other free stuff too. And I got, a, I have a, it's an Android, but it is a, what do you call it? Stylo 5. Stylo 5. Which is pretty cool. I mean, it's got a pen, different things like that. Like I said, it's not no iPhone. iPhones? I don't like iPhones. I mean, everybody has one, but I don't really like those. I'm know. an Android person, so. I don't know. It 
So I'm weird because I'm I'm gonna change change it up, but I'm weird because I'm into conspiracy theories. And I'm and I love me some Shane Dawson. Shout out to him. What's up? How you doing? Um, always watching his conspiracy theories. And you know, I think it's crazy the, th the things that go on. And <clears throat> tomorrow we plan on having a conversation about how it is, how it is for us to have to live like you know with um, help from the government, right? Because that it's not it's not a cakewalk at all. And I mean, people, there's people out there that abuse the system that don't need it, and then there's people like us that actually do need the help. So. No, there's some stuff we can talk about about that, but that comes this tomorrow or conversation or whatever. I mean, so stay tuned if you want to hear about all that. Jib, jibber jabber jazz, whatever you want to call it. And yeah, I need some more of this. <laughs> crazy how you know we live in a lodge right and I just tried to apply for the housing authority mm. and they're talking about it's going to be another year wait before they can place my family somewhere but we're living in a lodge and to a lot of people like in the government that's considered being homeless so how could you not find placement for somebody who really needs placement oh but you know that's 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 nothing here goes something else I applied for um, housing through the housing authority in Georgia, in Carrollton. And <laughs> I went for my interview. They called me. I went for my interview. And then they like, mailed me a letter saying that, oh, I didn't qualify because of my credit. Aren't you supposed to, like, put people who are homeless in housing? Like, of course... Uh, no, a homeless person is not going to have great credit. Come on now, really? Like, seriously? So, and there's so much stigma behind freaking being on food stamps and stuff and people, like, flaunting that shit and stuff. Like, I watched some vlogs and there's some women in there that actually get food stamps and stuff and they flaunt it like it's, like it's, oh whatever I get the food stamps yeah. I don't want to be on food stamps my whole entire life I want to be able to freaking support support my myself. family and myself without government assistance period like that's not that's not what I want to do I have one child she's 12 like after her that was it all these women out here popping out all these kids and stuff and getting all these freaking thousands of dollars in food stamps a month because you got seven kids because you don't know how to keep your legs closed type mess. That's crazy. I mean, I believe like you should live you should live within your means. Definitely. <laughs> and if you can't afford another mouth to feed, then don't Don't have babies. Don't. Because not only are you going to be struggling, but then you're bringing that baby into this world. And they're, you know what I'm saying? They're going to be struggling. Right. So, it's just not. Mm -mm. And shout out to Tammy, too. We like we like watching her, too. Oh, yeah. She's so she's funny. Hilarious. With so her, funny. With her. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I started long. watching her, and I was like, yep, girl. We gotta make a YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. Oh, and also we're gonna be on here getting some, t spilling some tea about some of these YouTubers that claim that oh they got this and they got that, but they don't. So I'm with that too. Like uh, what's his name? Uh, Nikocado Avocado. That that was some crazy drama. Like that was crazy. I don't, have you, you heard of him? You should watch that. That was crazy drama. What is his name? Nikocado Avocado. Avocado? Yes, because it's, all these YouTubers <laughs> be manipulating other people. Like, for real. 
and it's crazy like the manipulation and the lies and all this stuff that goes on we keep it 100 completely because there ain't no need for us to lie what we gonna lie for we we really don't have shit so and if you don't like the way i'm living you ain't gotta watch my videos but you really don't i mean we're just trying to get the facts out there that life is hard we're humans we have problems we have things and issues that we need to do like we're trying to change and stuff and do better for ourselves and everything but at the same time like it you just can't change stuff at night you know what i'm saying overnight it takes time and we work hard and try to balance being moms and wives, wives and then also trying to freaking better ourselves in other different ways that we need to as far as like school and all this stuff so it's difficult for real it really is and it's like no one really understands i don't know i get stressed out easily and i can't deal with people i'm not a people person and it surprised me to even be able to deal with her <laughs> for I don't real. think she liked me when she first met me. I, was, I think she was like, mm, bitch, get away, get away, get away now. <laughs> she popped in my room like, hello, how are you doing? I mean, because my daughter liked her daughter. They, they became friends. So I was like, you know what, why not? I'm going to go talk to her mother and see if maybe we can't become friends or at least good neighbors or whatever so that our kids can play together because... But, you know, I thought it was like a cat. You know, once you feed a cat, they keep going back over and over again. You know what I'm saying? And I'm a, <laughs> so and I'm a, a cat. And I'm a person that, like, just be wanting a space and just be in their room and uh, left alone. But since I got, I opened up and I was like, okay, well, you know, it wouldn't hurt. You know, yada, yada, yada. And then, then I found out we have a lot in common and oh, yeah. we act the same in mm -hmm. such many ways. Tell me how I have to get my gallbladder took out and then literally not even a month later she finds out she has to get her gallbladder took out. She started having back problems and I, I've always had back problems but our back problems are pretty much the same and it's like come on life give us a break. I'm 27 years old and I feel like I'm 89 living in a 27 year old body. Yeah. I feel old as hell. So, anyway, we're working with what we got. So, right now, our phone. <laughs> we're recording this off of our phone. That is connected to, because I've seen this on Life Hacks. Connected to a Haribo that is wrapped around a beet can. can. It works perfectly. All right. I mean, until we get and some money. And it's our stand until we get some money. No. So, I mean, it's, Tax doing, time it's coming. doing the damn thing. Tax is coming. Hey, when you're broke, you gotta work with what you got. We're gonna get this straight, you guys, for everybody. We're gonna learn how, we're gonna buckle down and learn how to edit. I know it's gonna take me like five, six hours to do this by myself. <laughs> I'm not technically challenged at all, but it's when new it, technology. Right. We gotta learn, and we ain't never done this before, so. Mm -hmm. It's gonna take us a minute. It's gonna take us a minute to learn how to edit. I might have to buy. I might have to buy some software or something. I'm definitely gonna invest in getting a laptop because I heard that it was easier to do that. I really want a, a Chrome, not a Chrome, but I really want an Apple, like a MacBook. But yeah. I might. I ain't trying to pay no thousand dollars for one. Uh, cause I That's like that Nene money. earlier when she was talking about that iPhone. Mommy, I want an iPhone. What was it? She said iPhone 6. Look, my child has a phone. She's got the same kind of phone I have. She's 8. And she's 8. But I monitor. I put uh, parent parental controls on it. Um, it doesn't cost that much for her to be on my plan. That's why she's on my plan. But if my child's going to have a phone, it's not going to be better than the one I have. You walking around with the iPhone 11 and I'm walking around with, with, no, with the Android. No, but baby, that ain't going to happen. My daughter's 12. <laughs> and Nayana, I mean, I love that child to death, but she's had several phones. And every single phone she that she gets, she busts it, cracks loses it, it, loses it, breaks it. And I'm like, girl, you are 12 years old. And the only reason why she had a phone in the first place is because she goes from here to Atlanta all the time for family and stuff. And then also she does wrestling and stuff. So it's like I need to be in contact with her. And every single phone, I swear she loses it. She went to go visit her dad 
over like Christmas break and she left her phone at his house and we ain't seen it since. So now she's like, Mom, because she wants to create a YouTube channel. That's what I want. I want you guys to comment down below about what do you think about these children about kids having creating YouTube channels. YouTube channels. Like, what do you think about that? What is the age requirement that you think it's okay for a kid to create a YouTube channel? Because our daughters want to have a YouTube channel so bad. Because they see all these other kids. Like, my daughter's a big fan of JoJo. JoJo Siwa. I don't know if y'all know who she is, but... Ever since she's seen her YouTube channel, she's like, Mommy, I want one. I want one. And I worry about influences. You know, right. how these YouTubers are influencing our children. And it's like a big conspiracy. It's manipulation. They're... No. They're influencing our children. And they're... It's like... It's like advertising. It's like brainwashing. Yeah. So. Because it's like all these little toys that they come out and you see and they're advertised on TV and and different things like that. Everywhere you go it's something advertised and it's like the whole world thinks, I gotta have that, I gotta have that because this person has it, I gotta have it too. So. Yeah, this, this shit's crazy. Yeah. This world is crazy. And what y'all think about the flat earth? Right, y'all think it's round or do y'all think it's flat? Because I think it's flat. Personally, I, I think it's flat. I think what they're teaching kids in school is sometimes not accurate. It, all of it is not accurate. What they teach in school is what the government wants them to know. It's what, what's what the government wants us to think. Believe. The things they show on TV is what they want us to think. It's like we got to have our own minds, our own brains, our own thoughts about what's going on in the world we gotta <laughs> stay informed because if we don't we're just being brainwashed but think about it though like if we really knew the truth about everything then he would probably take over and the government would be gone right because then we'd be all all these billions of people would be against the government right and that's what they don't want to happen so they show you some shit that's going on in the world but not everything because they don't want you to know it's like we're gonna title this as a late night chat because it is all it is is a chat we're bored and we're talking about a whole bunch of shit we, we're not <laughs> even like on one page one we're just topic. we like random, everywhere but everywhere. you know what these are thoughts that pop popped up in our head and we just figured we'd have a discussion so anything you want us to like have a discussion about, just comment. We'll, we'll do a YouTube video. Yeah, because I got a lot of things I want to talk about. I want to know some stuff. Like, the stuff I be watching on YouTube is crazy. I mean, there's a lot of stuff that's crazy. And then everybody's getting demonetized for this and for that and stuff. It's, I don't make no sense. But you know what? It's cool. Demonetize me, I don't care. <laughs> I don't. I'm going to speak my mind and say what the fuck I want to say. Excuse my language, but not really. Sorry, but not. Sorry, sorry not sorry. <laughs> Life. <laughs> my hair is not... I always want my hair right, up we got this, it gets we in my got face. This, we got this air on like it's giving us heat and it ain't <laughs> doing nothing. <laughs> nothing at all. We're sitting in the car wasting gas. For real. Wasting <laughs> gas. A lot of gas. Some we don't have. Well actually as long as we're sitting here and not moving we're pretty I have cool. a Honda Coupe and it's been in three accidents so it's, it's, it's struggling. It is struggling bad. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised it still runs. <laughs> But it does, thank God. My little dice. Yeah, she gave me her dice because her car is no longer here. <laughs> Ow! This, they're heavy. They're hard. Ow! Fuck! Yeah. <laughs> Duh. Hello. Whoops! That kind of hurt my finger. Did it? Yeah. <laughs> it hurt worse than that man scaring the shit out of me. 
<laughs> Look, when you're walking around late at night in a lodge, you have to watch. And I was not on guard. And I just seen this man part beside me getting shit out of his car. And I didn't see him until I got up on him. I was like, oh, shit. And he just popped shit out of up. Me. He popped his head out and stood up. And she was like, whoa. Drop it. He was dropping shit. And I was like, uh, sir, you dropped your bag. Like, <laughs> come on now. I'm trying to get in my car. You're taking too long. Hurry the fuck up. I'm cold. <laughs> Well, this video has been long enough, and yeah, we're retarded, video, so, so uh, we're going to let you go. I'm Kayla. And I'm Erin. Y'all have a good night. <laughs> don't forget to comment, like, share, and please subscribe. Thank you. Good night.